What the heck is this? What the heck is this? What is going on right now? There's another one. He's a sad little knight. Hey guys, it is Jessica, aka Player Tap That A, and we are back with another Not So Berry episode. We are here with the beautiful little Miss Zoe Berry. She's just taking a little bit of load off after work. I am gonna have her come over here and text Caesar. She's in a great mood, so why not now? Send a nice little flirty text out. Maybe he'll enjoy it. I agree, Zoe. It's a great day. Let's go out and enjoy the day. <gasps> Let's go! We made it to the Hare and the Hog Cafe. I do believe I got this off the Sims 4 gallery. So if you like what you see, please feel free to go ahead and show a little love on the gallery. Let's go ahead and ask him about his day. We haven't seen him in a few days. We haven't seen him since this weekend. It is now Wednesday night. Oh, how cute is this? They're sharing a table with each other. Mind you, they haven't ordered a thing, but they're sharing a table. He's in a silly mood and I'm having her brighten his day, but maybe we'll be romantic. Let's flirt with him. Ooh, yes, girl. Oh, good. They finally turned on the lights. I was like, is this lock going to be dark the entire time? Oh, his cheeks are red. Oh, they're having such a good conversation. They are getting their flirt on over here. Oh, I'm so happy we came out to see him. So he's heading inside. We probably should too. Ooh, look at these pastries. Ooh, I wonder if there's a bathroom here to prank. There is. Okay, she's gonna come and prank both of these toilets. It's like our favorite thing to prank. All right, so we're pranking this one. We're loving it. Now, I don't think we can prank the other one because I think that one's the men's bathroom. Oh, how awkward is this? I'm pretty sure we flirted with this. Oh, that's James Layton. We 100% flirted with him, but now we're just friends. Now we're just friends. Ooh, he's coming to sit back down. He's coming to sit back down next to, it, next to us. Yes, boy. Oh, good. Finally, the event is over so we can leave without him being mad at us. Okay, I think he's going to leave and then we're going to go ahead and leave for the night also. Bye. Yep, she went ahead and said goodbye to him. All right, so we're going to go ahead and head home. What a great date. He's really feeling us. And I feel like we're taking it slow too. I feel like it's going well. She's so cute in her little mint dress and her little shoes. Back home after another late night, but you know, we're young. We can do it. Go ahead and come in here and get a little bit of shut eye. I really feel like we should get her some nightstands soon. I don't want to spend too much of her money. I know we still have a few places in the house to decorate, but I think her room could be one of them. We still never figured out who gave us this. Ready for bed, and there we go. She is up. It is a little after six in the morning. I think I'm gonna send her to go for a jog. I love how she changed into this outfit to go for a jog. Yet yeah, you wait, she will change again. I told you, I told you she would. Oh, look how beautiful our neighborhood is. I love going for a run in this neighborhood. Be careful when you cross the street. Oh my gosh, look at the backyard of this house. How cute that is. Look at their floats. The house is gorgeous. We reached fitness level three. Heck yes, Zoe. Go you, girl. Go you. Girl changed into her summer outfit when she got done. Oh, it's summertime now. We'll have her come in here and take a shower after her nice long jog. Girl is getting fit. I'm going to see if I can't have her do a mind concentrating yoga routine. See if I can't send her to work focused. She took so long in the shower. I highly doubt we're going to be able to do yoga. She's got time for just a little bit of yoga before she has to leave for work. But it still might help. It still might help. And away we go. Welcome back to work, Zoe. I believe you will get promoted today. That is the goal. We will not settle for anything less. What's up, Jocelyn? <gasps> Eleanor is over here yelling at her computer. Caleb is over here. I feel like he is always at this computer. So if we really focus today, she could 100% get promoted. She's gonna come and chat with her buddy. Although I just remember we made something in the last episode and we never used it. It was the hover lamp. Still don't know what it does. We do need to do a little bit of experimenting on the chemistry set. I always love how this thing looked. They got a nice little cup of coffee there with little coffee stains, the little vials back there. It's adorable. <gasps> Who are you? Are you new? You're new. Do a nice cheerful introduction. Are you a new scientist? Her name is Sapria Delgado. Oh, nice to meet you. Okay, now we did get a crystal from Caleb, so we should come over here and analyze the crystal he gave us. 
one day we'll be a big bad scientist and we'll be able to let someone else run our labs and we'll just do the fancy stuff like go on the rocket ship Ooh, look at it go <gasps> we were successful we've reached the logic level four heck yes we have to complete that as part of the generation one of the not so berry challenge so we are on our way I wonder how much money we can make today too. I think the most we've made is like $350 without a bonus. We need to analyze a heavy metal and I'm gonna have her do that while she's at the station as well. And then I'm gonna send her off to go work on the rocket. Ooh, we found a new element, Fozone. Oh no, I'm pretty sure we broke the machine. This looks terrible. Or do we just need to clean it? Oh, we just need to clean it. Oh, okay. A little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little spritz there. I do not see a rag in your hand at all. All I see is you spraying a liquid all over electronics. And it's miraculously clean. Okay. Let's analyze that element, that foe zone that we just got. Ooh, we need to take a DNA sample from a sim. We haven't had that one yet. Eleanor, our good friend, Eleanor. Let's see if she'll be okay with us asking her for a DNA sample. Oh no, she said no. Eleanor, help a girl out. Maybe, maybe Caleb. We know Caleb better. I feel like he might be more up for it. No, Caleb, come on. We need your help. Okay, the only thing I can have her do is continue working on the rocket for 10 minutes before we leave because there's only an hour left in the workday. We didn't get to the third tier. I don't think we're going to get promoted. No. Becoming a successful scientist in The Sims is a lot di more difficult than I ever planned. I won the lottery, so I'm sharing money with my friends. Here you go. Is this because all you did was dance and didn't even help us put out the fire? $36? How small was that lottery? The end of our shift, we didn't get promoted! No! But we did earn $351 again and also got a vacation day again. We're home. She's happy. Clearly you didn't work hard enough today, so you should be in a good mindset now that you're home from work. You didn't work too hard, that's for sure. Gonna send her for a nice evening jog. Tomorrow for sure. We will definitely get promoted tomorrow for sure. Oh, there's our favorite place, Joe's Diner. Oh, is she is she thinking about going in? Is she thinking about going in? Imagine if we had open world platform and she could just walk right in this beast right now. Imagine. We are back home. It is 8.30 at night. She is done with her jog. I am going to have her send Caesar a text. Tell her she had such a great time on her date. Oh, wait. He's nearby. We can't send him a text. What? Where is he? Hello? Hello? I have no clue where he is. It says he's close by, but I have literally no clue. There's tons of other people walking by, but no Caesar. Oh my God, what is he doing at the back of our house? What? Did he just knock on our door, but the back door? Is he going to Joe's Diner? I feel like he's going to Joe's. We're gonna go to Joe's. We are here at Joe's Diner and who should be walking by? What? Crazy, Caesar? Oh my God, is that you? No way. No way. What are the odds? Why don't we ask him to hang out? What the heck is this? What the heck is this? What is going on right now? What? This is awkward. Um, is that, there's another one. He's a sad little knight. No, don't be sad. Why are there so many knights in there? Oh my God, there's another one. Oh my God, there's another one. What the heck? Never, never, never. I tell you the craziest things happen at this bar. And another one. What the heck? Oh, we don't like this person. Oh, it's Naomi. We already got in a fight with them. What the heck? Clank, clank, clank. Heroic, gentle persons gather about. Don your armor for night, night, and get a sweet discount. Oh, that's me. Oh, I like your armor. Ooh, your armor's on point. He decided to do push-ups on his own. I am not impressed. I am not impressed. So I'm trying to have her sit here and chat with her date, but all of these knights keep showing up instead. Oh my God, did she just steal the table? I think she just stole the table. Oh my gosh. I'm pretty sure she just stole this table. I tried to come into the family inventory, but you can't while we're here. Oh my gosh, I'm pretty sure she just stole this whole table. That's awkward. Okay, so our date, our date left, I guess? What the heck, 
sees her. I think he left, so she's gonna call him and be like, dude, get back here. You'll never believe what's going on. Oh no, Caesar went home, he's sleeping. All right, well, as beautiful of a night as this is with all the nights around, I think we will go ahead and go home ourselves also. Plus our date already bounced. Kind of awkward when they do that. I love that she can just run home. She can just go right up those back steps right there if we had open world. We just showed up back here at home and this girl's here also. I'm not really sure why or who you are, but let's meet you since you're out in front of our house at 1 a.m. Great to meet you, girl. Are you trying to get home? Okay, good luck. All right, we're gonna come inside, go to the bathroom, and then get a little bit of shut eye. And we are getting promoted tomorrow. All right, a little bit of shut eye. She'll wake up feeling like a champ. She looks like she's hungry, so I'm gonna go ahead and have her get ready to make something once she gets up. Unless there's something in the fridge already. There is. Yes. She is awake. She is feeling energized. We are ready to go look at that strut as she comes into the kitchen. She's up. It's 5.30 in the morning. She's an early riser, I've noticed. She is definitely an early riser. She is the cutest thing around, I swear. Now, as she's finishing up breakfast, I do want to go ahead and send some of this stuff off to the Geo Council. And if she could come out here and go ahead and check the mail, that would be lovely. Ooh, we have so many new elements that came in. I'm gonna send her in here to do a mind concentrating routine, see if she can't get focused before work. And then for her element rack, oh my gosh, we only have four more to go. We only have three more to go. Oh my goodness, we're so close. We are so close. Keep good form, keep good form, keep good form. Okay, good, we got her in the shower in time. Woo! We are getting out with moments to spare. Literally 10 minutes before we have to go to work. It is time for work and away we go. Today is the day of promotion. You know it, you can feel it. Back to another lovely day of experimentation. I do believe we have something bad in our inventory, which is why we smell so bad. We need to chat with Eleanor, analyze a fruit or flower and transform a chair. But let's come chat with Eleanor. And I'm gonna go ahead and slide this plate over here to the sink and get that out of our inventory. I think that that's what smells bad. No, our hygiene's just low. Why? We smell so bad. People are gonna hate talking to us today. Let's see if we can't get a crystal from her while we're here too. We need to analyze a fruit or a flower so we can come do that too. What is our mischief skill at? Okay, we've only successfully pulled one out of 10 pranks and that was on ourselves. That is not good. Okay, we need to transform a chair and discuss work with Cam Cameron Fletcher. Hmm. I guess we'll transform one of these chairs up here. Do it. Do it now. She looks so sinister. What are we transforming it to? It looks the same. Ooh, a baby high chair. <laughs> That's actually funny. Okay, and then, ooh, transform a light. Don't mind if I do. Ooh. So it turns it into something else that's similar. Do it, girl, do it. What do we got? What do we got? <gasps> ooh, that's actually very different. <laughs> that's very different. While we're up here, let's go ahead and get you to prank the toilet. She's like, I can't believe you're making me come back up here to prank this toilet. Gonna get her to go ahead and analyze a few more things. I'm wondering if she can analyze things eventually well enough. Does she not have to send things off to the Geo Council anymore? Anal Analysis complete. Ooh, and we found a new crystal. <gasps> That's gonna help us so much. Transform a pile of crates. Oh my gosh, we officially smell so bad. Don't talk to him, he's gonna smell you. I was wondering who Cameron Fletcher was and then I remember we met him on like our first day here. This computer is definitely broken. 100% it's broken. Oh my gosh, quit coming up to everyone when you smell so bad. It wants me to, oh, here's a pile of crates. <gasps> what is that? There's a little gnome in a thing. What? Okay, we finally found the crates that they want us to transform. Bippity boppity boop. What do we got? They look the same. Ooh, a table. A nice table at that. We should try to swipe that. All right, we do need her to work on the rocket too. Eventually, we might be able to actually take the rocket somewhere if we can finish enough of it. But it only needs us to work on it for like 10 minute increments. So that's where we go wrong. You got it, girl. All I know is I'm going to let her just continue building for the rest of her workday because we did it. We maxed out all of our skills for the day of work and we should get promoted. I don't care what anyone says, we should get promoted. I guess I could have her take a shower. I've never really used the quarters here, but I guess we could go ahead and take a shower here, right? All right, we are here. Oh, the Spice Festival's in town. Oh good, she brought her own shower shoes. Oh, well that's nice and sanitary. She is crying in the shower and I'm not quite sure why. Or oh, our workday will end in an hour, okay. No, she's about to do it again. No, 
you're using your own prank toilet. Don't. Oh no, she used her own prank toilet again. Oh, this is not how I'm trying to achieve our, our chief of mischief skill. And now she's embarrassed. Oh, and now she's uncomfortable. No. We were going to have such an amazing day at work. I don't know when it all went so wrong. We did it, you guys. End of shift. Zoe did a fantastic job today, and it won't be long before academic prestige and scientific achievements arrive. We've been promoted to a serum sequencer. Woohoo! Nine extra dollars per hour. We also received a $312 bonus, and we get a chemistry lab set. Hot dog. I am so proud of her. I am so proud of us. I am beyond proud of us. Look at her with her little goggles on. I don't know how you're all of a sudden feeling so inspired and great, but girl, you got a promotion. You should be so, so proud. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode right here. If you enjoyed today's episode, please be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you guys all Monday through Friday at 9 a.m. on Twitch. My name is Jessica, aka Player Tap That A, and I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.